On Smart Machinery Solutions, combine a handcrafted passion for progress with a pursuit of precision. Taiwan employs advanced techniques to make precision components and machine tools while innovating, integrating and automating within the industrial Internet of Things. Supported by cobots in this complete and future-ready infrastructure. We are pushing the boundaries of smart machinery. Taiwan, the pursuit of excellence. Taiwan's smart machinery solutions combine a handcrafted passion for progress with a pursuit of precision. Taiwan employs advanced techniques to make precision components and machine tools while innovating, integrating and automating within the industrial Internet of Things. Supported by cobots in this complete and future-ready infrastructure. We are pushing the boundaries of smart machinery. Taiwan, the pursuit of excellence. Taiwan's smart machinery solutions combine a handcrafted passion for progress with a pursuit of precision. Taiwan employs advanced techniques to make precision components and machine tools while innovating, integrating and automating within the industrial Internet of Things. Supported by cobots in this complete and future-ready infrastructure. We are pushing the boundaries of smart machinery. Taiwan, the pursuit of excellence. Taiwan's smart machinery solutions combine a handcrafted passion for progress with a pursuit of precision. Taiwan employs advanced techniques to make precision components and machine tools while innovating, integrating and automating within the industrial Internet of Things. Supported by cobots in this complete and future-ready infrastructure. We are pushing the boundaries of smart machinery. Taiwan, the pursuit of excellence. Taiwan's smart machinery solutions combine a handcrafted passion for progress with a pursuit of precision. Taiwan employs advanced techniques to make precision components and machine tools while innovating, integrating and automating within the industrial Internet of Things. Supported by cobots in this complete and future-ready infrastructure. We are pushing the boundaries of smart machinery. Taiwan, the pursuit of excellence. Taiwan's smart machinery solutions combine a handcrafted passion for progress with a pursuit of precision. Taiwan employs advanced techniques to make precision components and machine tools while innovating, integrating and automating within the industrial Internet of Things. Supported by cobots in this complete and future-ready infrastructure. We are pushing the boundaries of smart machinery. Taiwan, the pursuit of excellence. Taiwan's smart machinery solutions combine a handcrafted passion for progress with a pursuit of precision. Taiwan employs advanced techniques to make precision components and machine tools while innovating, integrating and automating within the industrial Internet of Things. Supported by cobots in this complete and future-ready infrastructure. We are pushing the boundaries of smart machinery. Taiwan, the pursuit of excellence. Taiwan's smart machinery solutions combine a handcrafted passion for progress with a pursuit of precision. Taiwan employs advanced techniques to make precision components and machine tools while innovating, integrating and automating within the industrial Internet of Things. Supported by cobots in this complete and future-ready infrastructure. We are pushing the boundaries of smart machinery. Taiwan, the pursuit of excellence. Taiwan's smart machinery solutions combine a handcrafted passion for progress with a pursuit of precision. Taiwan employs advanced techniques to make precision components and machine tools while innovating, integrating and automating within the industrial Internet of Things. Supported by cobots in this complete and future-ready infrastructure. We are pushing the boundaries of smart machinery. Taiwan, the pursuit of excellence. Good afternoon and good morning to our distinguished guests, friends from the media, ladies and gentlemen from all around the world. Welcome to our press conference. 
My name is Ariel, and it is my pleasure to be your MC today. Taiwan Excellence is a project sponsored by Bureau of Foreign Trade and carried out by Taiwan External Trade Development Council, TITRA. Today, we are jointly organizing this online press conference with Taiwan's Bureau of Foreign Trade, and we will be focusing on Taiwan's plastics and rubber machinery, which is very important to our bilateral trade. To begin, I would first like to invite Mr. Walter Ye, President and CEO of TITRA, to deliver opening remarks. Let's welcome Mr. Walter Ye. Deputy Director General Lee from Bureau of Foreign Trade, distinguished guests from the media and business leaders all over the world, good afternoon and good morning. On behalf of TITRA, Taiwan External Trade Development Council, I would like to welcome you to the Taiwan Excellence Plastic and Rubber Machinery Online Press Conference, Shaping New Possibility. In response in the increase in global crude oil prices and rising global and environmental awareness, how to improve the recycling and regeneration rate of plastic waste will be the most important issue in the future of plastic and robbery industry. Already, the development of plastic and rubber products has meant the introduction of green design and energy saving process. In addition, the use and recycling of biomass materials are now common goals of the industry. Taiwan is one of the top six plastic and rubber machinery exporting countries in the world. It's recognized for providing high quality products with refined technology and consistent performance. In response to the trends of Industry 4.0, Taiwan's plastic and rubber machinery industry is constantly upgrading and combined Taiwan's strong ICT and smart automation technologies. Building smart system and solution to fulfill the demand for cutting edge techniques developments and customized production. Through this press conference, we will demonstrate how Taiwan Excellence Award-winning companies help their clients set up an advanced production line to meet the demand for the small volume, large variety in order to create their own competitiveness. And and how and where competitiveness and a range. Today, four leading Taiwanese companies press from the areas of plastic and rubber machinery com companies, FCS, Hu Changxing, and Chan Power, Feng Ji and Din Ding Kun will present the latest industry trends and their newest technology. Two companies injection mach molding machines, high speed uh, stretch blow molding machines, intelligent all electric blow machine, molding machines, and five layer coal extraction for industrial strange wood. In addition to today's events, we will also hold a series of online activities such as one week Taipei Plus 
Digital Week from September 21st to 2020. To break social distance restrictions, strive for uh, uninterrupted business opportunities, we are looking forward to your attendance. Before I finish, I would like to express my sincere appreciation to you for joining us today. Please enjoy the conference. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, Mr. Ye, very much for your kind words. Please have a seat. I'd like to now invite Mr. Guan Zhi Li, Deputy Director General of Bureau of Foreign Trade, to make some remarks. Please welcome Mr. Guan Zhi Li. President and the CEO of Taitra, Mr. Walter Ye, representative from the four iconic Taiwanese companies today, and all friends online and offline, a very good day. I'm very delighted to represent Bureau of Foreign Trade, Ministry of Economic Affairs, Taiwan, to welcome all of you to today's online conference. Since the outbreak of COVID-19 pandemic, government of Taiwan has continued to focus on the demands of the industry and assist the business with vital support to reduce the impact of this pandemic. However, Taiwan Excellence is an award that celebrates high-quality Taiwanese products with innovative values. We have held various online events during recent border lockdowns to help international buyers find innovative products and the relevant services in Taiwan. Today, we are very delighted to have a representative from four of our most iconic plastic and rubber machinery companies to share their best solutions for improving production efficiency and capacities. Why Taiwan's plastic and rubber machinery industry competitive? Industry has been developing for more than 50 years and now formed a complete industrial clusters in Taiwan. And the industry is also famous for its injection molding machines, extrusion molding machines, and the blow molding machines, and has been globally recognized by the machines' high-speed molding, high precision, and the price competitiveness. And also, average amount of the export of Taiwan's plastic machineries have reached 1.1 billion U.S. dollars over the past three years which is 80% of gross production of the industry. And it put Taiwan as one of the world's top six plastic and rubber machinery exporters. Given Taiwan's advantages in smart machinery, smart manufacturing, and ICT, we believe that our industries will have the opportunity to add greater value to global production in the near future. And also increase in plastic awareness throughout the world means that the circular economy will be the next trend in industrial practice. In order to effectively implement the circular economy of rubber and plastic machineries, supply chains must be able to quickly respond to the new production requirements of innovative materials while minimizing energy and raw material consumption in the manufacturing process as much as possible. Upgrading machinery and equipment has become the key to this wave of transformation. Taiwan's Industry 4.0 Smart Machinery has consistently appealed to international manufacturers due to its flexible and customized technology, as well as its advantages in environmental sustainability. Taiwan is also continuing to expedite the development of environmentally friendly all-electric injection molding machines with such competitive features as low noise frequency and vibration output, which help conserve energy, water, and the cost. This, among many other advantages, is just one good example of why Taiwan's smart manufacturing is the best choice for industries. So you will find out all the details through the following presentations by our four companies. Finally, I would like to express my appreciation to all of you to share your time for joining our press conference today 
And I'm very confident that this event will be very fruitful to all participants and also wish everyone the best health and the success in your business endeavors because we believe Taiwan excellence is for your everyday excellence. Thank you. Thank you, Mr. Lee, for sharing your views with us. Please take a seat. Ladies and gentlemen, next we move on to the presentations. During this session, please feel free to submit your questions by using the QA link and QR code showing on the screen. We will collect all the questions and invite the speakers to answer during our Q&A session after all the presentations have been delivered. Today, we are very pleased to have Mr. Nelson Su from Fu Chengxing share their products. Let's welcome Mr. Su. Hello, everyone. My name is Nelson the sales manager of FCS Fu Changshin Machinery Manufacturing Company, the only listing company of injection molding machine manufacturing in Taiwan. Today, I'm very pleased to share with you our development and solution for multi-component injection molding. There are two segments for my brief presentation for everyone here, company profile, and product. FCS is not only the abbreviation of Fu Changshi, but with the meaning F for faster response, C for customer oriented, and S for service differentiation. FCS was founded in February 1974 with capital amount 48.2 million US dollars and years turnover 111 million US dollars currently. One description will explain the accumulative volume of injection molding machine we saw so far. The overall lens of Thai bar being used for assembly FCS injection molding machine is equal to total heads for 1,300 77 of Taipei 101. For injection molding machine business unit, there are four operations based and three branch offices in Southeast Asia. Besides injection molding machine business unit, there are some diversified business unit as well. This chart shows the general profile of four operation based in FCS group. It shows the top view of FCS headquarters in Tainan, Taiwan. This is the photo for the plant in Dongguan, China. Here is the photo for the plant established in Limpo, China. The plant in Ahmedabad, Gujarat, India is the one we established recently, which provides with prompt delivery and after service for customer locally. It shows that this distribution of our 30 of branches and 20 of agents worldwide. FCS possesses wide range of product lines for injection molding machine. The more canopy force ranges from 60 to 4,000 tons for various industry applications. Even we have rubber injection molding machine. Among the many injection molding machine company in the world, FCS is renowned for its dedicated two-component injection molding machine, which has been adopted and favored by many users for years. This two-component injection molding machine enjoys a high reputation through strict tests and real verification by market customers. FCS has formed four series of models consisting of more than 30 specifications, and the model contain Force range from 135 tons to 1900 tons. So, what is composite injection? We can classify by one process and two feature. By this two category to explain that can be easy to understand. Two K means two component. Distinct interface come with clear broader line within two shots. Insert molding. Troop of material, they come with joint area to link together, like our rear lens. Over molding, two of material surface stick on each other, like car side window. 
On certain interface, without clear borderline, it can be according to the material MFI and temperature effect. A or B can be crossed by hard or soft, depends on the purpose. This is the process of co-injection molding, A, B, C, D, complete part section view. You can see the material B is inside A, just like sandwich. So we also call it sandwich molding. A shot is for skin layer. B shot is for core layer. A and B injection percentage can be adjusted by demand. A and B material or color can be the same or different, but you can see the whether their physical characteristics are compatible with each other. This is our customer's application for bi-injection molding. With special screw design can emerge for various color and style. Bi-injection makes uncertain interface. Thus, each part is unique. FCS is the specialist in composite injection technology more than 35 years. You can contact us if any application is needed. As FCS is the specialist in composite injection technology, see below red dot line. We have created under 1,500 ton 2K injection molding machine in last 25 years. By the time being, the 2K parts makes demand bigger and wider. With the traditional type 2K machine, the heavy mold will be the restriction for its structure. Thus, we created a new model over 1,500 ton for big parts molding, like vehicle lens, sunroof, TV buzzer. This is our traditional 2K injection molding machine. It is limited up to 1,600 ton only. Because of more heavy loading will affect the structure. This is our new model 2K injection molding machine, HP4000R. To meet with market demand, we developed this new model 10 years ago. This kind of structure can be suited for any spec, even up to 3,700 tons. So, what is different between traditional and new model? I will explain more. Here goes the video first. See, before and after of 2K injection molding machine different structure, the pattern turning direction and injection location are all different. So, why do we need to make it different? The traditional 2K injection molding machine is our best sales for two component market. It can inject one side, light, right or left at one time, which is suitable for AM project. What is the difference between AM and OEM? AM means providing for after sales market purpose. So the order demands quantity no need to be equal for right and left. OEM means providing for car manufacturer. So their order will be always by pair, right and left. Our new model can inject one plus two, one pair light, right and left in one time good for OEM project arrangement. It is extremely good for pair parts molding, more of flexibility purpose than traditional type. Compare A and B, you can see they are in the same pattern space. A can only make one part at one time, 
but by B can make two parts at one time. It means when you want to make two parts in A, you need two machines at the same time. In the case of two component injection molding machine, there are five basic patterns. Based on five basic patterns, the definition of injection patterns of tricolor and four-color injection molding machine can be derived. Totally 19 configurations. The above patterns have been verified by the market. According to FCS, there will be 25 injection patterns of multi-component injection molding machine in the future. Here comes the injection molding machine to produce four-color tail light. So you can see there are four bears. Here is one example to diversify the multi-component injection unit combination. That's all my presentation today. Thank you for your listening. Thank you very much, Mr. Su, for your excellent presentation. Ladies and gentlemen, if you have any question for him, please scan the QR code. It will be showing at the bottom left corner on the screen. Next, we invite Mr. Tony Wu, Chom Power Cell Support Engineer, to speak. Let us welcome Mr. Wu. Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Tony. I am a cell support engineer from Chom Power. And my topic today is on high speed linear machine. Chom Power company introductions. Chom Power has five business divisions, which are Precision tool holder, stretch blow molding machinery, mold, green packaging, and intelligent agriculture. We have been in the manufacturing business for nearly 40 years. The headquarters is located in Taichung. Our manufacturing facility is able to produce up to 100 machines per year. We also have in-house machine center for both bottle and injection mold. As the leading manufacturer of stretch blow molding machines, we estimated that 90% of bottled water factories in Taiwan uses our machines for their PET container productions. High-speed linear machines. The third generation LSS8 was unveiled in 2018 Taipei Plus featuring output of 18,000 bottles per hour, which was the fastest linear machines in the world. It takes preforms as input, reheat, and blow them into bottles. In a cavity mode, it can process bottle up to 600 cc. Whereas in full cavity mode, the maximum bottle size it can produce is two liter. Let's see a video of how it works. Preform has been dumped into an unscrambled system where they are being sorted and slide down from the rail. Preforms are then loaded onto a star wheel and being inserted onto the mandrels. Once they are ready, the preforms can take in into the heating ovens and be heated to temperature of 110 Celsius degree. This machine is equipped with six ovens. And once they have been heated, the preforms have been taken by the robotic arms and transferred them into a clamping system where the preforms can be blown into final bottles. Once the process is finished, the bottles will be discharged from air conveyor to the downstream process. In case of a bad bottle, the, the bottles will be ejected from the system, from the line. Chum Power Smart Machinery. The Chum Power Smart Machinery is consists of four modules. They are Bottle Viewer, AVM, which stands for Automatic Virtual Metrology, Run-to-Run, and IPM, which stands for Intelligent preventive maintenance. The bottle viewer allows the user to use their portable device to view information such as production floor status, machine information such as running status, 
output quantity, and energy consumption. User can also see the maintenance cost for their machines. AVM, um, how it works is it measures the wall thickness of the bottle as it comes out of the mold. The system will use the data and generate a mathematical model to monitor the following blowing process. The third module is run to run, which gives the machine the abilities to process the parameter by itself. For example, if the desired wall thickness distribution of a bottle is set by this green line with run to run turned off, this value will fluctuate around. However, with the run to run being turned on, the machine will fine tune itself and the value would approach to the target value. The fourth module is IPM, which is Intelligent Preventive Maintenance. By placing several knock sensors throughout the machines, the system would monitor the vibration signature while the machine is running. If it detects any potential problem, a warning message would be sent so the parts can be ready and be replaced to avoid any unnecessary shutdown. Market applications. The application for PET industry can break down into two types. Beverage, such as water, CSD, and juice. Packaging, such as pharmaceutical and cosmetic and generic packaging. Each market has their own characteristics. For beverage market, machines is required to be operated at very high speed. For a medium capacity production line, you're talking about 300 to 400 bottles per minute. The blow molding machines often require to be integrated into the line. Therefore, reliability becomes paramount. So, machine for this sector is much like a sprinter running at very high speed. For the packaging market, the machine must be able to offer wide production flexibility, short format change over time, and able to accept molds from other machines. Therefore, the machine for this sector is like a multitasker. The following two videos will show how Chenpang machine be used in both scenarios. In a complete line, this line will start with uh, our linear machines, where the preforms are being unscrambled, infeed, heated, and then taken to clamping system for blowing. The finished bottle will then go to air conveyor system and being carried to the filling room, where they will be washed, filled, and capped. Once the product's being produced, labels being applied, and the bottles being packed into a cotton box. Once those boxes are sealed, they will be sent into a palletizing machine, where they will be stacked onto a pallet and then ready for distribution. As for the packaging industry, we offer two features. The first one will be quick manual change without tools. The second uh, feature is shell mold design, which allows the user for quick mold change and able to accept molds from other machines. With both features, the format change over times will be reduced from the typical four hours down to two hours. Conclusion, Chung Power, we have over 60 models to meet all your PET production needs. Therefore, please be sure to speak with us before making any purchasing decisions. Thank you. Thank you, Mr. Wu, for your impressive presentation. Again, ladies and gentlemen, Please scan the QR code to submit your questions.
And now we're very pleased to have Mr. Charles Wei, the CEO from Fong Key. Please welcome. Good, good. Hi, everyone. I'm Charles Wei. I'm the CEO of this company. The first, I would like to introduce FKI. Our company was established in 1953. We are a plastic extrusion manufacturer. 90 up to 95% of our products are exported to the over 110 countries with uh, 5 up to 10% in Taiwan Dockery. Please let us watch the company video first. Okay, thank you. Now I want to introduce our products. And the first, for the promoting, we are separate it into the two types. One is the continuous type, one is the accumulator type. The continuous type can produce up to 30 liters, and the accumulator type can reach 3,000 liters. Then, as for the flexible packaging film, the design night speed is up to 450 meters per minute. Also, the industrial packaging, such as the release paper, paper boat, woman fabric. Moving up, application for this uh, plastic brofim machine. Application like uh, agriculture film, garbage bag, shopping bag, and the film width can produce up to eight meters. Now, for the sheet extrusion line, we have a mono layer, multiple layer, up to five layers. The application, ABS, HIPS, PP, PET, PMMA, PT, PC, and PMMA also. Next, our coal extrusion film machine also have mono layer, multiple layer, up to five layer, with application like a PE stretchy film, barrier film, multiple layer CBP film, and TPU film, and PEVA film also. Here, I would like to move on to introduce our new model, all electrical blow molding machine. There's a three-layer jerry can with the single head double station. As you can see, the product is a 20 liter jerry can for the chemical use and net weight of 850 gram with a jammering mold. Production capacity is 257 bottles per hour and the cycle time is 28 seconds. This benefit driving market demand for this electrical blow molding machine are low maintains, no pollution, and cost efficient, but with the higher capacity. However, if compared with the electrical and the hydraulic machine, the advantage is power consumption. By reduce about 20 percent, and the capacity rate can be increased 15 percent. On top of this, we also offer the new tech system for the smart manufacturing industry 4.0 with a SCADA system. 
This helps operators to get more human basic management in the machine. FKI in part 3, 4.0, interface function page. You can see this is the menu function page for the operator. It is easy to understand which function is going to proceed to the machine. Main page of the control system, similarly, the main function page allow operator to check machine data easily. To control each item, just use the touch screen. Here, the system remind customer about the machine maintains data. For example, monthly anniversary can be shown on the right side of the page. Focusing on power construction, it was each machine unit KW, H, and a tick power chart to the next customer control which part is more active. Turning to the turning to the camera, through the camera you can check every moment with an inside view of the machine. And the even protect the operator while the machine is running for 24 hours. Now, and finally, we have a quick view to show the machine running performance in case this video this uh, in 2019 we re presentation in the Tuseto cooperation with them more than 23 years and in this period we did a lot of great job together they are uh, the number one for technology advantage technology the after sales service uh, and uh, all kind of the exclusion line it has really good technology and we are happily introducing this new machine, the all-electric blow molding machine. I'm proud to say that in the electrical blow molding machine, where we won two awards at Taipei Plus in 2018, including the best overall design and design award for the blow molding machine category. To find solution for extrusion problem, Taiwan can help. FKI can help. So contact by email, build our website. To watch more video, please subscribe to our YouTube channel and Facebook online. Thank you, everybody, for your time today. Thank you. Thank you, Mr. Wei, for your comprehensive presentation. Again, if you have any further questions for him, please use the link on the screen and we will answer them at the end. Next, ladies and gentlemen, we will invite Mr. Eric Wei, Vice Chairman of Ding Kun. Let's welcome Mr. Wei. Okay, good afternoon, everyone on the media and the guests around the world. I'm Eric, the Vice Chairman of Ding Kun. Today, I make a brief presentation on TK's product. At the beginning, 
Let me introduce Ding Kuen Company. We established 1981. We focus the plastic extrusion for the blow film and the fibers. In these 40 years experience and stories, we not only cooperate with many European suppliers and manufacturing, we are also get the license of ISO and CE and for the last versions. And our company almost 100% export in the world. Next, I want to describe our main departments. First is our assistant. We have the blow film machine department. We supply the three layers extrusion, five layers, and up to seven layers. For the medical hygiene, food packaging, and the containers. For the industrial packaging, like the stretch hoop, string hoop, especially for the stretch hoop. It's no need the heating system when you making the packaging. It's very important and the best surrounding friendly. And it is also the fastest packaging speed. And also, we supply for the construction film. Like for the geomembrane film and also the 12 meter greenhouse film. TK supply the multi-function themes for industrial film, agricultural, aquaculture, and also the medical hydrants also. And you can see we have another department is for the monofilament making machine. We can supply the, the machine for PA, PE, PP, PET, PLA, and EVA and also some biodegradable uh, monofilament. We also supply for the machine to make the polystyrene taps by Brady Young. It's very special for the netting and the roping marking. And our third department is to supply the net machine. It's very important for the vegetable, fruit, and the plant packaging. We have three departments, and here we can also give you a news. Our high tenacity monofilament can create at least 9 gram per denier to 13 gram per denier. It means we can supply the longer life and make the fin softer. And here, the 40 years, we continually cooperating with many European suppliers, Switzerland company like the Kundik, the Denmark company like the Robco, Italian company Qnex and Dokeco, also the Germany company Plus Control and the K Design. And we also work many material suppliers like in Taiwan, Formosa, like in European, the Isomobile and the Middle East Sabic. If you visit our stand in K, Xiao, in Dusseldorf, Germany, 2019, we use Metallosan PE in place of EVA, which is the in, uh, traditional solution in the market. And here, we want to tell you our new model, the five-layer co to produce the stretch hoop. Six new functions. The number one is the high efficiency extrusion for the multi-layer blow film. The two is minimal energy consumption. You need to know, actually the main energy consumption is from the heating for your raw material. That's why it costs your machine waste many energy. And today, TK, our newest screw design for the extrusion line. We solved this situation. We made the new 
main energy from your material shear stress and shear rate. Very special design for the gap of your extrusion. It will be 70% to 80% energy consumption safe. Very important to save and improve your missing quality too. Dinkun invested to establish this research office, department, and the equipment. Today, we can tell you one kilo product only take you 0 0.15 to 0 0.20 kilowatt hour. It means 20% to 30% energy safe than your before product. And you can see the number three, number four, and the number five, the automatically online calibration, the data acquisition and the analysis system, and the automatically feeding system, and automatically gauge control. It's for what? It can be very useful to avoid your people mistake and error. It's very easy for you to control the quality. Even your operator or your engineer is not available next by your machine. And the last point, the most important for you is, we supply the IIoT gateway to provide secure access to remove technician service. What's that? It's not only the system to give your people training, not only collaboration, not only education. It also supply very important inline loop feedback, like you training quickly, easily, collaboration automatically, and educate your people fastly. Later in the page, I will explain detail. And now let's see what the product for this machine. For the film, application is very far, uh, very wide. Vacuum film, stretch film, string film, stretch hood, string hood, as you see. And besides this product, our company also supply for the monofilament T dye for the different market. You can see the different function and application. They follow plate rope, agricultural rope, marine, fishing, boat, also including some sport net, and a shuttle net, greenhouse net, agricultural grass also. And let's see the most important item, the new function to drive your smart machine. Due to the traveling limit of the COVID-19, I think you very urgently need a technician service. And now, TK can give you the solution. IIoT gateway to supply the security access to calibration your machine automatically and online. You don't need any traditional technician in your factory. But what function do you need? Data integration is the first step at the beginning. Even your old machine, your current machine without this system, you can upgrade in the future from TK system. Let's see how to do. When you want to make your manufacturing smart, very important to customize your manufacturing. You need to detect and remove problems automatically. Report, adjust exactly, improve efficiency, stability, and quality. And the most important is to decrease your human resource cost. It's not simple work. Not only from our machine, it's also, it's also including your currently downstream machine. But our system can collect all data from our machine and your currently machines to give you machines smarter. This system also gives you the cloud service. You can download the 3D view for the complete machine. It can let your people to training, maintenance, education, very easy. This cloud is open source. 
you can go into our cloud system from the Siemens gate. Thank you for your attention. Thank you very much, Mr. Wei, for your wonderful presentation. Ladies and gentlemen, in other upcoming events, Plastics and Rubber Industry Show Taipei Plast Digital Week will be launched next week from September 21st to 29th. The event consists of online CEO panel, online talks, Plast Spotlight, and the Taiwan Trade Show match. Please stay tuned by scanning the event QR code showing on the screen right now. The first program will be online CEO panel on September 21st. Professionals from representative manufacturers in the plastics and rubber industry will present the market trend, innovative technology, and products, and then online talks will be held in the afternoon. Starting from September 22nd, selected videos featuring new products of companies will be broadcast at 3 p.m. Taiwan time at the Plus Spotlight for six consecutive days. The Taiwan trade show match will be held on September 29 to ensure exhibitors' business opportunities and expand their sales in the international market. For more information of Taipei Plus Digital Week, please scan the QR code on the screen. Next, we will move on to the final session, Q&A. Ladies and gentlemen, please take a few minutes and use the link and QR code on the screen to submit your questions. Now, ladies and gentlemen, we would like to invite the Director of Titra Strategic Marketing Department, Mr. Mark Wu, and all the representatives of the award-winning companies to join the Q&A session. Due to the time constraint of this press conference, our staff has selected the most relevant questions. The others will be answered online after the events. Now, I will first read out the questions and then invite the appropriate speaker to answer it. Our first question is, what kind of products and solutions are Taiwan plastics and rubber machinery makers offering to help enhance this industry during the pandemic and in its aftermath? Dr. Wu, would you like to respond? Okay. Uh, with the increase uh, in the global environmental awareness and the uh, plastic bans, the supply chain of rubbers and plastics must be able to quickly respond to the new production needs of innovative materials in order to effectively implement the concept of circular economy and minimize the energy and uh, consumables in the manufacturing process as much as possible. Facing the trend mentioned above, Taiwan plastic and rubber industry suppliers substantially simplify production lines from multi-tasks to the one procedure through massive capability of integration to reduce energy consumption of the production. The industry also develops and processing uh, techniques of green materials and provides turnkey transferring uh, solution of green procedures in order to assist customers apply green materials and techniques to build up high performance, high yield, and low, per, low per, uh, pollution production lines to achieve smart manufacturing with the concept of sustainable circulation and help customers improve competitiveness. Thank you. Thank you very much, Director Wu. Next, we invite Mr. Nelson Su of FCS to answer the following two questions. First, does FCS provide after-service, such as providing replacement parts in case of a breakdown? Second, for the operation of FBR and HBR multi-component injection molding machines, do we need further training from FCS, or can it be easily operated? Mr. Su, would you like to respond? Okay, for my answer to the first question, yes, as the supplier of injection molding machine, FCS knows well that after service is one of our most important missions to be committed. 
they possess abundant replacement parts in 30 of branches and 21 of ranges worldwide to provide with comprehensive and prompt after service for our customers. And my answer to the question is, FCS multi-component injection molding machine possesses friendly control interface and the various choice of language such as Chinese, English, German, Portuguese, Spanish, Russian, Turkish, etc. for users. With machine delivery, we also provide with owner's manual and training section when we install the machine to the customer's plan. Besides that, we use online app like WhatsApp, Nine, WeChat to guide the users if they have any question for machine operation. Thank you. Thank you very much, Mr. Su. Next, we will invite Mr. Wu of Chang Power to answer the next two questions. First, how much will the production cost effectiveness incurred if you produce bottles using Chang Power L series machine? Second, what companies use your machine to produce bottles? Mr. Wu, would you like to respond? Oh, thank you. Thank you for the asking the questions. Um, as for the first question, in my presentation, I talked about our linear machines is designed specifically for water line productions. And uh, for medium capacity size line, right? This is talk, this is, the output is about 300 bottles per minute. So before the second generation, or before the second generation, it, re it will require a 10 cavity machines. But right now, with our third generations, only eight cavity machines required. So therefore, um, you, you could spend less, meanwhile achieve the same output. Uh, we estimated the, um, the cost saving in the capital investment is around 16%. As for the second question, I believe it's come from uh, Indonesia, the media news. Um, for our in Indonesia markets, the, uh, some, some of the famous brands that use our machine to produce the bottle are Clio, Vit, and Senkwa. And in the past few 20 years when Chum Power has been in this industry, we sold almost 3,000 machines globally. So we believe we are really an expert in the linear machines. Thank you for the question. Thank you very much, Mr. Wu. And next, we invite Mr. Charles Wei of FKI to answer the next two questions. First, what is the production capacity of the three-layer blow molding machine per month? Second, this machine has been distributed to which countries? How is the market enthusiasm there? Mr. Wei, would you like to respond? Okay, thank you. <coughs> For a full electrical machine, we are start to, to sell from 2018 and now we can produce 240 bottles per hour. So it's me, per month, we estimate will be around 144,000 pieces. Thank you. So. And the next question, the full electrical machine, we are start from 2018, and until the 2018 type of plus and 2019, the KCO, we already sold this kind of the machine to the Brazil during the KCO. This customer, they are one of the, our biggest customer in the world. Also, for uh, the other area, like uh, Canada, Mexico, Peru. So, thank you. Thank you very much, Mr. Wei. Last, we invite Mr. Eric Wei of Dinquan to answer the following two questions. First. How many percentage decreases in the energy consumption of this machine when compared to other similar machines? Second, will the online and automatic machine calibration affect the effectiveness of this machine? Mr. Wei, how would you like to respond? Okay, 
uh, let me respond to the first question. Um, it could be decrease roughly 20% energy consumption at least. The PID is the optimal power consumption for the machine. Besides, we make the spatial design instruction that using high torque motor in place of multi axial gears. This change brings high stability, longer life of the machine and a simpler maintenance process. The greatest benefit is that the performance efficiency is energy saving of the machine are very highly improved. And, and about the next questions, the automatically online calibration will be improved the effectiveness of the machine. For people, it takes a long time to do administration, detections, and the troubleshootings in manufacturing design. However, the automatic online calibration can detect and remove the problem just in time, which means no need, uh, not only the effect, efficiency, and the qualities can be improved, but the cost of the manpower can be decreases. Thank you. Thank you very much, Mr. Wei. Ladies and gentlemen, the press conference has now come to an end. Thank you so much for your participation. We hope this event has helped give you a better idea of the new innovations being developed in Taiwan. Please remember to complete the questionnaire and share your valuable opinions with us by scanning the QR code on the screen. Have a beautiful rest of the day. Thank you.